I think Sierra knew exactly what her bridesmaids wanted to wear. I feel like she probably talked about it because this was a surprise to them too. So they knew they were in the wedding, but they didn't know what they were going to wear. And they didn't know that she was working on having things made for them. So um, it was kind of a surprise to them and secretive. She would text them back and forth. Hey girl, what size are you? Uh, what size do you wear in a bra? And you know, they reply back, why are you asking me these questions? One thing that I love that Sierra was really keen on was about doing these beautiful lace chokers for all the girls. And um, she loved that we got this beautiful French handmade black lace to, um, to do for all the girls, just like this is a little choker and they tie it in the back. And I love that because I think it makes all the looks cohesive. Uh, the dresses are black, correct? And I think many people might be surprised. Bridesmaids' <coughs> dresses are typically some sort of pastel color. Yeah. Why did she want black? I think Sierra didn't want to take too much attention away from her gown, which is absolutely gorgeous, by the way. Um, I think she just wanted to stand out and she wanted her bridesmaids to also feel comfortable. Um, some of the dresses that Sierra did for her bridesmaids would probably range anywhere from like $6.95 to $14.95. So they're very affordable, very user friendly, very easy to wear and easy to care for. The bridesmaids, the girls, they absolutely get to keep the dresses. It was a thrill to work with them. Each one, you know, was so lovely and um, they were like a blessing to, to just be around. It's nice that Sierra has such incredible people that she works with. She's all about clean, modern, sleek, sophisticated lines. And I think that what she had for her overall vision was just classic, something she could look at, you know, 30, 40 years from now, her and Russell together and look at these images and they look, they still look fresh and new. I have to tell you, we FaceTimed at least 10 times a day and text each other 1 a.m., 2 a.m., 3 a.m., just to make sure that we got this right. I love how hands-on she was in the whole entire process. What's up, guys? I'm Juliana Rancic, and you're watching the Live from the Red Carpet YouTube channel. Subscribe today, then be sure to check out our other Live from the Red Carpet videos right here.